inside the relic now, that its hull will block all outside communications. We have some privacy at last. In what little time we have left, I have a great many things to explain. After that, you will need to make a decision. First, you may have noticed that we are being pulled into the ship. The strike suit travels faster as we move toward the core. There is a massive amount of fold energy permeating the entire ship. As a result, you will be unable to transform until we reach the shielded central chamber. obstacles we encounter. By now, the Colonials will have realized what we are trying to do, and will turn the relic back toward Earth. for some time. There have been many steps leading to this point. Sending the signal, merging with Dr. Abram, designing the strike suit, even choosing you. Comatose, but they found a way to control the relic and turn it against you. 
I called your fleet to Thorn, so that you could bring me here. I did all this so that I could be made whole again. This is what the strike suit was designed for. It is the only ship that could survive the journey. It can reunite me with my body and free the mind of Isabella Abram. But I needed a pilot to bring me here. I needed someone who would listen. Someone who had shown they understood when the orders are no longer relevant. I chose you. I hope I chose correctly. ahead. In the final chamber, you will find the ship's core. Destroy that and you will destroy the relic as per your orders. But the colonial fleet will remain and the battle will continue. The resulting explosion will create a fold in both space and time. Even I cannot predict with any certainty what will happen to us then. We could be thrown back in time. Dr. Abram and I might end up back on Thule. You could find yourself back at Orbital 17. We would meet again in the timeline that followed and reach this point. In that scenario, destroying the core seems futile. Or you can do what I brought you here to do, and destroy the limiters that surround the core. They are designed to prevent another mind doing what I am about to do. Take control of the ship. Allow me to do that and I will alter the storm and turn it on the colonial fleet. Your planet will be safe and your war will be won.
allowed me to make myself whole again. Thank you. Once Control had taken back the relic, she stayed true to her word. She used the storm to paralyze the colonial fleet, and then we showed them the same mercy they had shown us. In the aftermath of their victory, mankind didn't think too long about their saviors. The vast, intimidating shape of the relic still hung over Earth. We didn't know what Control's intentions were, or what she would do next. But for now, at least, Earth was safe. Although the battle for Earth had been won, it had left its own legacy on the world below. Space platforms crashed into the ocean. Debris from a thousand ships fell across the world. In our fight to save Earth, we had not done enough. Our world was dying. The remnants of mankind were left no choice but to leave their world behind and start looking for a new home.